The salvage team that has for the past one week sought to recover the bodies of a mother and her child who drowned in the Indian Ocean has now resorted to technology to complete their mission. The team will from Monday make use of res high resolution cameras that are set to help improve visibility in the deep waters. Raquel Moigai with that report. The last seven days have proved to be nothing less than agonizing for the families of Mariam Kigenda and her daughter Amanda Mudeu as the retrieval operations proved futile. But the announcement by Colonel Lawrence Gituma, who is spearheading the search operations, a flicker of hope might be ignited. We are getting uh, an advanced system of uh, remote operation, uh, remote operated cameras uh, to our estimation they'll be able to give us a better resolution of the bottom so that when we are sending people down, then we'll be sure that uh, the risk that we are, taking to t uh, we are taking to take people down is commensurate, but not an haphazard one. According to Colonel Gituma, the high-resolution cameras are already in the country and will be put to use on Monday. The strategy now is b will be more reliant on equipment and less reliant on physical uh, uh, sending down of uh, the human beings there for verification. With a such operation concentrating on the middle part of the ocean, where four key points have been mapped out, the team insists that the safety of the divers remains to be of utmost importance. <laughs> because of the recompression, the divers are supposed to go slowly, at each every depth interval of 10 feet, they're supposed to stay there for three to five minutes so that the bodies can acclimatize. What does it mean in this operation? It means that, uh, and going forward, is that uh, the bottom time is going to be reduced. Reports of a South African team of divers have been confirmed to be a private plan by the family of Mariam and Amanda. But as for rescue efforts led by the Kenyan government, Monday marks day eight of the retrieval operation. Raquel Mugai, Citizen TV.